A to for ruining my brother and his wife's pregnancy news with the news of my recent diagnosis. Bit of backstory, my brother and I are very close, his wife and I not so much, we've had our fair share of tension. Anyway I fell sick in the middle of May, but held off getting checked out, because of covered and safety reasons. Eventually when June started I decided to go check it out, turns out it was stage 2 breast cancer. I decided to tell my family two days ago, since lockdown laws have been lifted, so I invited everyone over, and when I told my brother and his wife he said okay that's fine, because he has news to share too. So our family gathered, and my brother decided to go first, he did ask me, and he announced that his wife is 4 months pregnant. Of course everyone was overjoyed. After about an hour they asked about my news, and I knew this was probably the last time in a long while before I had everyone here in person, so I told them. And of course the initial joyous atmosphere was gone. The rest of the evening was a lot of support for me, and not a lot of attention on my brother and his wife. My brother didn't seem to mind this, as he was quite distraught with my news, but I saw his wife pretty upset and cornered off. So I decided to approach her, and I apologized for the timing of it all. She told me I could have waited a bit, and Skyped everyone with the news, as it's just stage 2, and let my brother and her have this moment with their family. I told her I initially called this meeting for this exact reason, and she said she knows, but I knew my news would damper everyone's mood. So I told her she's being ridiculous, and I wanted to tell my family in person, since they are my family after all. And she burst in tears, and demanded to go home, which my brother obliged to even though he was confused. He promised he would come see me soon, since he stays close by to me. Later that evening I get a message from him asking if I told his wife that she isn't part of the family and that I deliberately wanted the attention on me because that's what she's upset about. Also the next day my parents called me to check up on me and my mom mentioned that my brother's wife called yesterday evening really upset telling them what I said and claiming I'm jealous because she's pregnant and I'm trying to ruin her life. I told my parents what actually happened, and what I really said, and it's caused not only tension between his wife and me, but my parents and her too, and now she's also blaming me for my parents not being her biggest fans. My brother is torn, but has been trying to talk to her, which results in more tears and a strain in their marriage. All this drama is making me think that I should have just called up everyone rather, or just told my brother that his news had to wait, even though that would have been selfish of me. I really wanted my family's support that day, but I'm starting to rethink whether it was worth all this drama and potentially causing further problems. So Reddit, Ata, Edit, wow I didn't expect this to get so so much lovely feedback, and to think I was slightly scared to post this. Thank you all for the unnerving support, love and hugs. I read, and still reading, every single comment made, and I really really appreciate it. I will most definitely fight through. Thank you all so much. Just wanted to add a few points, when brother told me he had news too he was really super excited and added it as a just by the way I'll announce mine too, he did apologize and admit afterwards, if he had known what my news was he would have held off his, because right now what's important is my recovery. He also admitted he wrongfully assumed that my news would automatically be good, I'm usually always the happy chirpy one. His wife wasn't too fond of this either brother's wife also had a miscarriage beginning of the year, which is why this pregnancy I suppose was extra special. I'm truly happy for them, I just wish she could understand, like one user pointed out, that this isn't a competition. I don't know why I couldn't tell him over the phone, we are really close, and I knew it would have crushed him, I couldn't steal him away at the gathering either, because he was the last to arrive, and when he did he just quickly mentioned hey op mind, if I go first, and I was frozen on the spot, so I said sure. Also pretty silly on my part. It's hard to explain, that feeling where you absolutely frozen, and there's a big lump in your throat, that prevents you from speaking, but saying the news in the first place, was really difficult to begin with. Edit, just another point to clarify, I'm not a saint, but my brother does mean a heck of a lot to me. It's exactly why his wife and I cleared the air between us before, 
because I wouldn't deliberately make his life hell by annoying her. Hence why when I saw she was upset I approached her. And when she told me I could have Skyped I responded with I wanted to tell them in person, since they my family and they would probably want to be there with me. When I broke the news, I never once implied she wasn't a part of it. My brother and parents know this. Radid comments. NTA, you called the meeting for your news. Also, if sharing it in person was unimportant then why couldn't you still share the pregnancy news over Skype? Her own reasoning should have been good enough for her. And good luck with your treatment. My thoughts exactly. Also I bet, if Op did try to stop them from their announcement I suspect the Sil would have gotten upset still. Also NTA. Yup. Bottom line here is, all the drama is coming from Sil. She is the one making the situation worse for everybody, but mainly to herself. Op, you should focus on your own health right now. NTA, and my best wishes for your recovery. Precisely, if anyone there needed to tell this news in person it was Opus. This was Op's event to begin with, which brother and Sil hijacked. Op needs personal support at this time. Sil is being entitled to the maximum and obviously a constant friction creator with her crap. No doubt in my mind that Op is in the right and Sil is constantly trying to make things about herself and control everyone with her crap. NTA. I was so ready to call you it from the title alone. But you arranged this meeting to break the news of something very serious and your brother decided that it was time to break news as well. Could you have handled this better? Well, yes you could have asked him privately what his news was when he said he had something to announce so that it didn't get awkward like this but regardless, the blame does not fall on you at all. But the fact is that cancer is, like, a bit more of an important thing to announce than a pregnancy and the sill made a huge misstep getting jealous and saying what she did, Skype? Really? She's definitely idiot here. There are things more important than a pregnancy, especially because a pregnancy has a lot more of a time frame to announce than a disease you're going to need to get some pretty obvious treatment for. Also I wish you a good recovery. Especially because a pregnancy has a lot more of a time frame to announce than a disease you're going to need to get some pretty obvious treatment for. Seriously and she's 4 months along. If the Sil believes Skype is an acceptable medium to share a cancer diagnosis then it's also an acceptable way to share a pregnancy which she had weeks to do before this family meeting. I know your brother asked permission and I'm sure his wife was dead set on making this announcement but you don't get to act but hurt when you hijack someone else's family meeting. You brother and his wife could have also called a meeting for their news and should of. NTA. Sil is also a massive R for lying about what Op said to her, just so she could get more people on her side. NTA. You're the one who called the family gathering. They hijacked your gathering to share their news first. She doesn't get to be angry with you. She could have waited another month or so. She also could have said something sooner. If anything bro and wife should have felt so bad about telling their news. After hearing Ops. I mean. They did ask first, and asked to go first, so they aren't to blame. But if I was in a similar situation, and then my sister came out with her devastating news, I'd feel so bad for telling such happy news, when she is going through something so terrible. How selfish can one person be? This is T and I stole your thunder this is a tragic medical diagnosis. How dare Sil, make it about her. NTA Opus. And I feel sorry for your brother. His wife is a selfish and uncaring. Who says it's just staged to cancer? NTA. You are absolutely not the R. Do not let your crappy soul make you feel like an R. You invited people over to your home with the explicit mention that you had news to share with them and your stupid soul knew this and instead tries to blame you for taking some of the thunder. I didn't know there was thunder to take from someone sharing they have a cancer diagnosis. You have cancer, and you don't need her crap. Seriously. Focus on your loving family, and being together, and working through your diagnosis. Let the stupid still blame you for whatever. Your parents have your back and that's what matters. Sorry, she made herself look bad to your parents all on her own. You are not point the R here at all. Please don't think that. And sending you so much love. 
I'll be honest, in that what brother's wife said that op said, is the truth. You do not just magically become part of the family when you marry someone. You have to actually be part of the family. And this whole little temper tantrum she's thrown. Says she's not trying very hard to be part of the family. She's being petty and childish over a cancer diagnosis.